We're also following developing news out of Pompano Beach today. Trouble on the tracks today after a Brightline train clipped a car. And local 10 News reporter Terrell Fournier is live on the scene with this close call. Terrell. Well, this accident is actually being blamed on the driver. And here is why. You see that sign right behind me? It says, do not stop on the tracks. Well, the driver of this car did just that. Now, let's go to this video from Sky 10. The collision between the Brightline train and the vehicle happened about 9.15 this morning. This is Dixie Highway and Northeast 33rd Street in Pompano Beach. The train eventually stopped. Unfortunately, the car was only clipped, but amazingly, no one was injured. Let's go to this other video showing you a closer picture of that car. The front end, as you can see, sustained some heavy damage. The woman behind the wheel was apparently test driving the car with her mechanic. They pulled up to the traffic light when the train warning signs were then activated. She says that she couldn't back up, realized her car was partially on the tracks, so she and the mechanic jumped out. That train clipped the car. The woman returned a few minutes later after the accident and found that the vehicle was still able to start, so she managed to pull it into a nearby lot where she was met with BSO. Out now, live to the scene here in Pompano Beach. Again, no injuries to report here, but the driver of that car, she was cited for BSO, again, for not following that sign of avoiding stopping on the tracks, perhaps a lesson we can all learn from. Reporting live from Pompano Beach this afternoon, I'm Terrell Fournay, Local 10 News.